to Talk Radio. You are now in the host queue. Blake Bortles threw for, he was 32 for 46, 336 yards, one INT. So what? He plays for the fucking Jaguars. And one touchdown. I also like the fact that he was 5 for 38 on the, on the ground. Yeah, he's going to call her. Let me, uh, let me take the caller. Caller, you're on the air. Uh, good evening. Uh, I had a question about the uh, Detroit Lions. Uh, you know, they're the number one defense in the league right now. Do you believe that's a correct statistic, or they're uh, still going to be exposed and fall farther in the rankings? Now, you know what? I think Detroit has got a great defense. On um, the front four... If you take a look at the front four, you'd have to argue that that's the best front four in the business. And if you're playing, you get the Vikings. You're playing the Vikings again, and and, and well, they're they're the playing Green Bay Packers. Well, they're playing. Uh, uh, Was it New Orleans this week? You think they're going to get exposed? I know Jimmy Graham's not going to be playing. I don't think so. Um, I mean, I think I think if 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 Ingram's going to play, or if Robinson's going to play, or Pierre Thomas is going to play. I still think they're going to th- think they're going to play pretty tough. Mm-hmm. I mean, are you are you from Detroit? Is that your team or no? It's just uh, I I was uh, lucky enough uh, in my fantasy league to pick up uh, Detroit's defense before anybody else wised up that they were uh, actually pretty good. I picked them up in week three, and uh, they've been dropping some major points in the fantasy leagues. Uh, last oh, week yeah. uh, in ESPN's fantasy leagues, I believe last week they dropped twenty. Uh, because they had eight sacks, uh, I think three interceptions, and possibly a fumble. Yeah, you know, I watched that game. I'm a, actually a big Vikings fan. So that was a pretty tough game for me to watch. But it was interesting because I, I have Detroit in one of my leagues as a, as a defense, and I actually got them off the waiver wire. And then I also had Arizona. I mean, I'm in like 10 leagues. So I have a mm-hmm. couple of different defenses, but I've really tried to get Detroit in most of my leagues right now. Right. And also I have Arizona. So in one, one of my games, I had Detroit starting over Arizona. And then my other game, I had um, Arizona starting over Detroit. And in my league, um, I do a couple of Vegas leagues for FFPC, the Fantasy Football Players Championship. Mm-hmm. They got me 22 points in that league. And that helped me win a game. Well, you know, that's and funny then in that my you, Arizona that you, league. Ari- that you say that I actually have Arizona. Uh, as my other defense, uh, I actually ha- I used to have before I picked up Detroit. I had um, New Orleans defense was actually averaging me negative points, and uh, so I picked up Detroit <laughs> and uh, I've been playing them over uh, Arizona. And I have one other question. I'll let you go. Uh, when was the first time that you realized that you were gay and you were taking dicks up your ass? <laughs> oh, were you Jesus. were you about ten, nine, or Who ten? You start fingering your own asshole for pleasure, and then you got a carrot. Start just fucking the shit out of yourself, bro. We're on the air, man. You gotta keep it clean. Fuck, fuck, shit, dinger, why would you, fuck, why would you fuck, say fuck, that? fuck, cocksucker, motherfucker, and tits. Why would you say that, bro? I'm sorry. Why, why wouldn't would you say, he say that? Like that? Why wouldn't he say that? Yeah. Go, go, fuck your motherfucker. Yeah, your fingers smell like your mother's fucking dildo. Where your fingers been, bro? All right, you know what, guys? Are you gaping for it? Are you gaping cool. for a football yeah. or what? Yeah, he's gaping a for a in dick in his ass. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for using blog. Oh talk my radio. god! Oh, I got to forever. Another call. Hey, God. That'd be awesome if a guy could get a uh, football in his asshole because it gave uh, that big. If That'd other be people awesome. know, how to, know how to talk sports, uh, I'd be more than willing to give you that link. I have no idea I, what you're talking I did, about. I just figured that was a uh, that was just a way to waste some time. <laughs> well, I, that's because I'm like the only fucker in this <laughs> in the print call game that actually watches uh, sports. I got a couple here and there people that I. Uh, Message me about sports. Hockey fan is one. Uh, horse dick, when he's in there, he's another one. Actually, horse dick, his, uh, his uncle's on a sports, uh, sports station around here that I listen to. I'm like, oh, yeah, dude, Welcome I know you're going to listen Radio. to all the time. If you desire to speak I love that name, horse dick. Press one at any time. And-
Pilots will be notified that they're talking. You are now in the host queue. And now I've got another caller in calling from a 212 number. <laughs> So, you know, thanks a whole lot for nothing. Thank you. <laughs> I'm definitely going to get the audio from that just to oh get the fucking God. rage out. That's fantastic. That's awesome. That's probably the like, best that's a- Thank you for using Blog Talk Radio. <laughs> the fucking show. That's, a, that's fucking awesome. I'm getting the audio from that shit just to. I'll do a fucking two minute video and release that.